Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Africa Agriculture Adaptation Atlas Hackathon Challenge. My name is Braden Youngberg. I'm a research specialist at the Alliance of Biodiversity International and CIOT, um, and we're excited to be leading this challenge. Uh, the Alliance of Biodiversity International and CIOT is an international uh, research organization, um, and we're focused on delivering research for a sustainable and food secure future. Um, we are part of the wider uh, consortium of CGIAR research centers. Um, I'm part of a very international team of scientists and researchers that are very passionate about data analysis and visualization. Um, and we are working on the African Agriculture Adaptation Project. Our team is primarily based in Nairobi, Kenya and Montpellier, France. Um, and we work to convert big data into digestible data stories that policymakers can use to make informed decisions. Um, and we primarily do that through uh, the building of decision support tools. Um, the Adaptation Atlas aims to be a very community-driven project um, and something that's open to all and for everyone. Um, that's driven a lot of our decision-making throughout the entire process of this project. Um, so running a hackathon is like a natural fit because we believe that none of us are smarter than all of us. We have a total of six challenges uh, that we've built in partnership with multiple different governmental and non-governmental organizations. Uh, the aim of these challenges is to build data stories that address critical issues related to climate change, agricultural production, and human health. These stories will address specific questions that have been posed to us by real-world users of the Adaptation Atlas um, and from, from these different agencies and organizations, um, meaning that the outcomes of this challenge can and will directly lead to real-world impact. Um, the challenges that we're running are focused on six different things. Um, so the first is climate change and its impact on rainfall and growing seasons. The second is the impact of climate change and anthropogenic factors on forest covers change. Um, the third is the impact of climate change on water security and how this affects agricultural production across sub-Saharan Africa, and then how this water security can be addressed through different adaptation options. The fourth is how pest and disease will affect agricultural production under future climate change scenarios. Um, the fifth is soil health and how future climate um, hazards may impact and compound the effects of poor soil conditions on agricultural productions in certain areas and identifying where those areas may be. And the sixth and final one is climate change and its impact on human health, which focuses on the impact of vector-borne diseases and their distribution under future climate conditions. For all of the challenges, We'll be giving away a first prize of $1,000 um, and a second prize of $500. US dollars. Um, additionally, we'll be giving away $750 to the most innovative submission um, across all of the six challenges, um, as well as another $750 for the best female submission across the, the six challenges. We're incredibly excited. Um, and really looking forward to the different ideas uh, that you come up with for these data visualizations. They're going to require some creativity um, in terms of data analysis, in terms of data visualization, um, and piecing kind of the whole story together. We'll be available throughout the entire challenge uh, to answer any questions that you may have. Um, and yeah, really looking forward to seeing what you produce. Let's drive the driven decision-making together. Good luck.